Good morning. This is early morning coffee talk on a Thursday on Black Friday. Now, I would love to say that um, it was planned to do this on Black Friday, but actually, I forgot. I and I forgot only because I got up at 2.54 with the dog. So by the time it was time to do early morning coffee talk, I had been up for a long time. So here I am on Black Friday. Um, I am not doing any shopping on Black Friday. I have been overwhelmed by the amount of um, commercials with bye, 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 bye. And it just, it, it makes me kind of, whew. I'm reading this book, To Hell With The Hustle, which kind of goes along with the Black Friday, like, do we need another TV? Do we need another TV or another TV? Um, you know, to each his own, but I just really feel the um, pressure of Black Friday. Now, not to mention, or not to say that long ago, man, me and my mom, me and my neighbor Carly, we would get in the car at 4 a.m. and get coffee and go down the toll road to get to Target or Walmart or, you know, wherever. Back in the day, um, when it was fun, when you needed to get guitars for Guitar Hero and hurry up and get those things that the, the boys wanted, but now they're older and bigger and it's just not fun. They want money and gas cards and ski passes. So you don't have to hustle for that. But anyway, here I am. Happy Black Friday. And it's pouring here. It's been pouring for a few days, which is way different for us. Um, it's been really great and really nice. But John's out right now trying to get water out of the spool because it's gonna overflow. So he's out in the rain with a hose trying to get the water out. I said, use buckets, let's just use buckets. He said, no, that's not the way you do. So anyway, I wanted to talk to you about 2020. I wanted to talk to you about the serenity prayer and I wanted to talk to you about um, a few things associated with the serenity prayer. And I only have six more minutes, so this is gonna be fast. So let's talk about this um, serenity prayer, um, prayer, serenity prayer, better together box um, that we are actively working on. Now, it's not that it's Black Friday and I want you to go out and buy this, but um, this is something that is going to outlast even the holiday season. It would be a great gift. It would be great for you, um, but it doesn't have to be because it's Black Friday, you need to go buy it. Doesn't mean you can't either. So when you get the box, you get a set of these 12 cards. Well, they're, yeah, yeah. They're super colorful. I will say I made them and I like them, which is not something I usually say. I know that sounds weird, but just go with me. Um, they are heavy duty. We left them blank on the back so that if you wanted to write a note, if you wanted to write um, a verse that goes with it, like this one here, the desire for radical change must come from within. Boom, right? It's, we've got to want the change, okay? So all of these cards, super colorful cards, um, they come in the box. There are 12. You can also buy these by themselves on the Love Squared Etsy um, site. Okay, then you get a super big colorful um, print of the Serenity Prayer. Okay, here's me. I made this. I love it. It's very colorful, but it's not my style. Do you see my style? Kind of shh whatever. So I wanted to have one that was just cream and white with the words, not all the colorful. Um, but it's not about me. But guess what I, I came up with? I think God told me, just do the one on the reverse. So when you get the box, you actually get two of these. But if color is not your thing, boom. So you get two of these. You get the 12 cards, 
And then you get to choose one of the bangles that Lisa up in Seattle is currently making. So this one is Courage. Can't, it's hard to see on this. But you get to choose between Wisdom, Courage, Acceptance, and you'd think I'd know. Wisdom, Courage, Acceptance, Peace? I don't know. See why I'm not good at promoting my product. But these are perfect. They're the perfect size. You can wear one. You can wear them all. Um, they're just good. So that's what you get in the box. Plus, I'm working on a little project where I'm going to write you a little note. I haven't got to that yet, but maybe today. So, that's the Serenity Prayer Box. Now, um, we mentioned in um, the post that all of the words that I've cut come from the AA Big Book. Now, I've gotten a question. What's the AA Big Book? Alcoholics Anonymous. Anonymous. Alcoholics Anonymous Big Book full of stories of recovery. I love it. Um, I have two of these big books. Now, this is a really big book because it has, I ordered it or I found it with, um, with large print so that I could cut the words out and use them in my projects. But um, as you can see, I have cut many, many, many a word. It's a great, resource. It's a great tool. It's a great book of stories of recovery. Um, I, I came across this. I got it out of Salvation Army and I had no idea what it was going to um, mean to me. It, it just, there's so much possibility for transformation and freedom and recovery and you just gotta want to do it, you know? Um, the words are so good. So if you ever come across an Alcoholics Anonymous big book or you go on Amazon, um, I would highly suggest that you find or try to find the large print. I might buy them all, but um, again, so many good words that I cut from this and then I use on my projects, on my cards, in my journals. So that's what the AA Big book is, okay? All right, now I'm getting close to the time, so I'm gonna stop, and then I'm gonna make another video so you get two today.